Good morning, good morning. My name's John Wright. Right now, I'm in the gas chamber. I'm going to turn that down. It's going off. But I just turned on the Republic or the Democratic Party. And I just want you to know that I do it and I do it with a survey like this. My survey goes like this. Here I am on the internet. I'm all, I'm all over the internet. I know what Ron DeSaints and I know what everyone's up to. Gene's next to me. Joe's next to me. We're happy. We're going to make it happier. Right now we are in happy land, you guys. And I'll tell you what. Our girls, we want them queens. We will not let the women go down. And we're not going to let the men go down either. We're not going to let Donald Trump do this shit to you. If you want that, you go down Donald Trump's row and you'll be welcoming crap in. But saying that alone, you know, I study people of the way they walk, the way they talk, the way they goddamn chew gum in the morning. And I, most women like it when I tell them what I think of somebody that they say, well, what do you think of somebody like this? And I'll say, oh, I'll tell you what I think of them. Then I will tell them if there's a good person or if there's a bad person. Now saying this, here's Lily. This is one of the first people that I had met. She lives in the Netherlands. And this woman, she's wearing blue because she wants us to come in blue. She wants us to come in blue because she needs protected. And I know that because I know this woman. She's in the Netherlands. They're expecting us to come blue because they need help. They do not want to be held hostage in this goddamn Republican crap. So they're running from fucking this. They're showing their true colors, what they want their men to be. And here's another example of this morning. This fine, respect, respectful, full woman that Donald Trump would tear apart right here. She was wearing orange rebel. She went straight blue. I'm standing right there. I'm telling you. This is what they're doing. The saints and them are lying. This woman's next to me on the internet. You know why? Because she's close to my heart. Joe Biden's close to my heart. This woman's close to my heart. This woman's close to my heart even. I don't even have to look at this and I know. We're on the line. Look what's up above us. Look at this. We got the military and they're turning their back on uh, the saints and them. They're coming our way. Blue is coming on, and we love the blue. You see, this year, we're going to go blue, and you know why? Because my girls tell me this. My girls tell me this. You see? You see that blue? They treated us bad long enough. The goddamn treated us bad long enough, and I've done fucking praise the price for all of us. I'm willing to stick up with us, and I'm willing to come with our president. I'm willing to help out you. Look at the future of Donald Trump shit. I guarantee you Donald Trump will try to lay you down a bull, blue road of bullshit so he can win. But the truth is, is my coffee cups in, comes in multi flavors, not just the black Cooper fucking cup. They stuck my, my family's face across the United States of America. This is my brother Jerry right here. He lives up on the Middle Fork Road in Lewis County, Washington. He hides behind a fence. Why? His little brother will rip the fucking head off of him and stuff it down his windpipe, just like he's been threatening me and millions of Americans. He was a no good Boy Scout. Maybe he was trying to tell me so I could come back and save you because he knows that I'll kick the fuck out of everyone's ass before I get his. And that's just my fucking style. Anybody that puts a goddamn child in a fucking cage like this and calls him Clarence the Cross-Eyed Lion, I have feelings for Clarence Thomas, so don't, don't push it. And I got a lot of goddamn friends. And my friends, we're rebels, and we're fucking mad as blue this year. We got hearts of gold.
my girls tell me this, and I'm giving you a live shot because I want everybody to know. I study things, and I goddamn fucking try to get things right every goddamn day because we can't afford to get it wrong this time. We've got too much online. Joe's right there smiling with me. Why? Because I'm here. I came forward. I told you the truth. Donald Trump cannot be our queen. He cannot be our king. And he is no fucking James fucking Bond. By the way, I didn't know it was going to be set up. We're going to be rebels. We're coming in orange and we're coming in blue. Look at my shirt. There I am. 35, like the 35th president of the United States. I was named after John F. Kennedy. I'm not going to fucking take you into fucking nowhere land. And you know what? If Joe needs a vice president, I will go there and I will fucking be there with Joe Biden. I will help him. Or I will just help him. And we'll make sure that he's got an excellent person to help him you know and we'll make sure there's excellent people in the United States of America and like I said I get this right every time just follow my goddamn cup excuse me follow our cup because our cup this year is the winner's circle and it's our winner circle you know it's not my fault what they done and they laid the trap and it's not my fault what they've done to us and now we shut them off and I always do things and I like things in one cut and I like things in one take my mom and dad we should not pay for what our our elders have let done just because their past was fucking broke like these glasses right here these very glasses that I witnessed my dad wear and bring this to my attention, I swear it was true. I wouldn't stand and tell you the things that I do because I love you. And I love my women. And I love my friends. And I don't care whether you're gay or what. As long as you guys start love me, I see somebody in the corner. I, you know, I do not blow smoke up people's assholes. But I'm just the goddamn asshole to fucking come in and say, what the fuck do you think you've been getting away with? And we are not going to put up with it because when it all comes together, Donald Trump will be standing alone and only the scumbags will stand next to him. You'll see exactly who he is and who they are. And my brother Jerry, either I love you and you brought me to the goddamn fight in such right style and profile. You may as well have saved your ass, Jerry, from the beating from me. And you fucking know I'd goddamn rip your face off and stuff it up your fucking ass. And I'd be aware anybody thinks they're going to fucking rip me off again has got a goddamn thing, another thing coming. Good morning, America. And I will not let it happen. I will not let it happen to you. And you know why? Because the real D.B. Cooper's son is here. And the fake ones, they're not. And I am. And I'm here with you. And together. Together are the men. The women. Whether you're gay. Whether you're straight. But if they're full of hate against you. Me and Joe will come in and we will like that. And Carmella, I will not toss you under the goddamn bus like they did in California. Thank you very much, you guys. Thank you so much this morning. Support your president. Don't ask what your president can do for you. Let's do what we can do for our president and your neighbors in the United States of America. Band together, stick together. I'm telling you the truth. And you saw it here first.